Alright. Okay. For this second part of our instructional series for uh, managing the AV room is we're going to show you how to apply minus one uh, CD with a singer. Alright. So then first we'll go over here and we'll use our CD player. Our default one is here, the Sony. Oh, we also have the Magnavox. So here, so here we're going to load in our CD. So we're going to load our CD right here. And then we'll wait for it to finish reading. And then we'll go to the appropriate track. And then we'll click the pause button here just to keep it on hold. And then once you have your track ready on the CD player, we'll press the Oxen USB tab right here. We'll press it. And then we'll go up here to uh, auxiliary 5 and 6, which is the output for the Sony. We will unmute it. As you can see, uh, both sides mute, unmuted at the same time because they're linked. So you only need to press one of them. And also for the slider, it's down here for 5 and 6. You only have to move one of them because since they're linked, the sliders will move together. Okay. So we'll put it up. Uh, between 20 and 10. 20 and 10. Yeah. Okay. So, Maynard, uh, which one is aux? What what is controlling? What is what is aux one and two control? Okay, for aux one and two, um, it's controlling the sound that's coming out from our backup CD player, which is the Magnavox. Okay. And then here, an auxiliary three and four. Three and four. Uh, this is controlling the sound coming out from our. Uh, PC output or the Mac or the or the Mac yes yeah okay from our Mac computer all right okay. so how do you mix the two just uh, play the CD oh yes okay now we will play the CD so we go back to the, the Sony and we press the CD player as you can hear there's music coming out from there and then we push it up or down depending on whether the music is too loud or too soft. Once you have a volume that you feel comfortable with, we'll go back here to the input. Oh, so what, why did you press that input there? We need to go back to the input so that we can control the volume of the singer. And uh, Like for example, if you... Now for example, if they had the red mic here, we make sure that the red, uh, the red mic is already unmuted. Mm -hmm. And then we bring it up, and then you can hear their voice. And as they're coming out of the speaker, we can increase their volume or decrease their volume so that we can mix it and blend it in with the uh, sound of the music. What channel is that red mic? The channel for the red mic here is uh, channel 4. And then the yellows is? The channel, the channel for the yellow mic is channel 5. Alright, okay. so. I guess that's how simple it is to mix the mic and the and the music. I guess. Yes, it's uh, pretty simple. Just uh, just know though that everyone does have different ears, so uh, <laughs> we will just try to you know guess appropriately, and uh, uh, hopefully everyone is pleased with the mix that we're providing.